<laughs> a lot of peaches made it into top 64 in New York City. I love it. One of them, of course, being Sam Sora. <laughs> yes, we got Sam Sora, we got Ling Ling, we got Jack, as we see right now, and we got him going up against the Wishes, playing Trainer. Good start right now for Jack. Yes, Jack's around with a nice, decent bit of percent there. Wishes not been able to get too much of an opening yet, kind of just getting some stray hits and get some extra chip damage. And, but right now, I mean, dang, I mean, that's a lot of damage that's unanswered right now by Jack. I mean, yeah. by, uh, by uh, Wishes. I apologize, I have mixed him up a little bit. Just finally starting to get a bit of an opening, though. Oh my goodness! Is he gonna do it? Oh, <laughs> he did it! And that's I, his first stock. I guess that is quite the comeback from being down by a lot yeah, and taking was, the first stock. He was out a quickly. decent chunk and got one opening. Mm -hmm. You really can't let Trainer get an opening. Like if you let Squirtle get an opening, you're taking 70. You let Ivysaur get an opening, you're possibly dead. You let Zar get an opening, then what you're getting outplayed. <laughs> Oh my goodness, the Pokemon trainer yesterday, uh, I forget who it was, who just went solo Zard for a while. That was, was Beast, like, that's the guy's actually playing you. Losers. That's right, yes. BBM Beast. And actually he went to an Undiscovered, I remember that after the set yesterday. He went to an Undiscovered one time, I think for Smash 4, but other oh. than that. But other than that, then I remembered. But we're talking about this match right now, yes. and this match, um, Wishes is still able to hold on to this first stock. Jack He's just holding needs his lead oh my very goodness. well. Nice follow-up, is he going to get this kill? Not yet. Ooh, nice swap to Ivysaur <laughs> there on the ledge. This is ledge play from Wishes. That was actually really nice. Yeah, Jack is in some big trouble right now. Right. I just want to see. I mean, Jack needs to get this stock, get some momentum going. I mean, a 112%. This is rough. Yeah. Up throw on the no platform. Way. Is that going to be it? Not yet. Just want to remind everyone that Charizard up throw is weaker than the Ivysaur down throw. But uh, platforms exist. Oh my goodness. And that there. Oh, there you go. But at 133, I mean, he could lose his stock very easily. Not going to count out Jack at all. I want to see if Jack could even bring this back and make it even an even, uh, you know, uh, maybe get a stock lead. Doesn't look like it, though. He's off stage. There's going to be trouble. Especially with Ivysaur there. Ooh, and the umbrella. That, that wasn't going to reach the stage. Yeah. Unfortunate for Jack, and just uh, basically a stock, a whole full stock lead right now. Oh boy, Saturn. Love me some Mr. Saturn. He's in some combos. There you go. This is the this is the start that Jack needed right now. Oh, but instead. What's she going to instantly just fight out of it? Squirtle's neutral is so good. This is a fast kid. He can throw so many <laughs> hitboxes that's so hard to deal with. It's so hard to hit him. Oh no! <laughs> uh, that, that, he hit Mr. Saturn instead. I think yeah. he had forgotten he was there. Maybe. Or maybe we're just trying to throw a quick little mental game and hit Saturn and get back. Uh-oh. It's back so in Jack forward in, air there. Jack is in trouble. Jack's in a very bad spot right now. Ooh. She's doing a very good job at just holding this lead and just keeping Jack pressured and keeping Jack in a bad spot. Oh. That was nice. Oh my goodness, but it's still able to recover. I thought he might have just uh, just uh, gimped him at that point with the turn up. Ooh, up got a shield from Wishes. Not going to hit. It's going to go unpunished. That was what Jack needs to get that stock. He's not going to be able to capitalize. Oh. And there's the game. Game one going to Wishes. Yes. Very dominant game from him at that, too. Jack not looking too happy about that. Yep, shaking his head a bit. No one switching at all. We're going to go right into game two. All right. And this time on Smash Bros. So right back to the stage. Mm -hmm. This time, last game, Jack had a good start. He was doing a good job at getting openings. And just lost it immediately. Yeah. The thing is, Wishes was still able to get a few pokes in, and then when Wishes finally did get that good raw opening, it w literally was a stock. He just needed the one opening. That was it. That one opening, he was able to get the down air, edge guard, and get the kill. That's all he needed. I feel like that's the big make or break thing here. Like one of the things about tr one of the things about Trainer that makes Trainer so good, in my opinion, is his ability to just close out stocks 
so effectively at so many different percents. Like, there's down throw up B, there's edge guards, the Razor Leaf has combos, up air can kill early. So this character has so many options. I was sure S Smash is also very good at ledge trapping. I don't know if Wishes goes for that much, Ooh. as we just seen. Never mind. Hey, is that the Noku? Yeah, that's the Noku. <laughs> <laughs> now the Noku's charging it. That's that was true. more of a call out. That's true. Shout outs. Yes, shout outs to the Westchester boys. We're gonna see. A, you're gonna hear a lot. Of that. That's the Westchester stream of Westchester commentators. Right. Not Westchester players. So we got these two coming out, and Wishes again with a very good start with the lead here, sitting at 156. However, but it's nothing that Jack can't come back from either. At 167. It is not. Uh, you know, he can get this and make it pretty much even with socks. All Jack needs is a kill move and a good combo, and it's an even game. But right now, oh my goodness, this Zara is putting it work. Wishes is all over him. 87 percent, just making it rougher and rougher for Jack. That's I be gonna go over the F tilt, and that's gonna get the first stock for Jack. Seeing at 87 though, he needs a couple good hits in to get even up this game. And even then, if he does even up the game, that's still just an even game. Yeah. Against a player who is one of the better players in this room, one of the higher seeds in this tournament, phenomenal player. Ooh, yeah. nice toad there. I'm wondering though if Jack can, uh, or if Jack can make this comeback work for him, man, and make it make it just about even. He's he's gonna be in a good spot. Which has been doing Ooh. such a good job at using that down air through the platform. So just get on extra chip damage on Jack. That's the big issue. Jack's taking too much chip damage. That's what it is. That's where it's all falling apart. He's just slowly taking more and more damage without being able to get in a good opening. All right. Ooh. He was using the, the turn up to, to his own advantage, his wishes. A little bit of a hesitation there after hitting that turn up. Could have maybe gone for an up air or something, but just wasn't really sure what to do after. Didn't get punished for it though, so it's all, all good. It's all okay for wishes. However, Jack, no down throw. Up B, gonna DI in, so he's not gonna be able to get off of that up B. So he's gonna get hit by the up air. And now he's at 111. It's gonna be another two stock. Back to Ivysaur. Another two stock to, to death to, uh, for uh, Jack? It might be. This is looking very rough for him. Back though, gonna get him off stage. Is Jack gonna be able to close out the stock while he's off stage? Not quite. But there Ooh. it is on that one. Okay, there the we go. There. He has a dot eyes. Yeah, now we got the even in stock. Never mind, he has regular. We definitely not in percentage. No, yeah, no, no. I thought okay. it, there was a dot. Oh. But able to escape there that combo again. with the Pokemon again, Switch. That down there through the platform. Jack, watch out for it. You've been hit by it so much. Oh, you hate to see it, you really do. Like, Alrighty. Jack cannot be happy about this. This has to be frustrating. Well, he's got uh, potentially three more games if uh, he can win all three. Yeah. Are we going to go back? 2-0 and two very dominant games from Wishes. This is going to be hard. There we go. We're going to go to Battlefield instead. So a chance for each of these players to live a little bit longer. Here's the thing about this Battlefield pick, though. Yes, it's a good stage for, Pit for Pete. It's also a very good stage for Trainer. I was kind of playing some other characters there, maybe. Anyway, yeah, sticking to the Peach. Alrighty, let's get into it. Game three, this time on Battlefield. Uh, so, of course, Jack's choice. Let's see if it'll work to his advantage. Already, which is starting off with just everything, Razor Leaf. Jack just backing himself into the corner with that Razor Leaf and still getting caught at the end anyway, trying to pull a turn up. Like, again, that's what I'm talking about, the chip damage, that's all it is. He's taking so much, just little bits of damage, and it's racking up so much. Like, right now, Jack's sitting at 26, and he hasn't been hit by, like, any good, like, actual opening. This has been quick little pokes. Granted, Wishes at 70, Jack doing a much better job this game than any other. He has a very good lead belt right now, because he hasn't let Wishes get that opening. But even then, and there's the opening. So that Wish is going to get 62% off of it, nothing too bad, but he's going to keep his advantage here. He's oh smashes, that's two now. Oh, oh, oh my goodness! B and oh. that's going to be the stock. So another early stock loss for Jack, I mean first stock loss for Jack, but I mean it's just a little bit closer this time around. This match has been a lot better, it hasn't been more one-sided for, uh, for against Jack in this match, anyway. This character, Pokemon Trainer, I are specifically just so good at just finding kills, finding openings to set up a kill. Oh, he had a nice counter, but it did not connect. Did not. He had the idea, just wasn't able to get it. 
was just trying to end these stocks off stage with his Zard very early. It's one thing Zard is very good at is he can kill you off stage very quickly, especially with Rage. Oh, 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 oh no! Okay. Well, that's how you get, make it even. This ain't even. <laughs> I mean, even it's, if the stock counts not I, at all. I, I'm in the not game. counting out Jack. You know, I'm it's not, not gonna either. have faith. I have faith, but it's gonna be so hard, and it's just not been. It's not been fun so far for Jack looking into this. He has been kind of frustrated. He has been climbing a hill this entire game, or this entire set, rather. Had a good start to this game, and even then, with that amazing start he had, he's still down right now. All right. Oh, my goodness. Jack just hasn't been able to adjust. Everything he's been doing, Winston's been able to find his way to poke around it. It's just... Not been great for him. Gonna get the read on that roll, and they're gonna get him off stage. Oh, I do like how Pokemon Trainers have been using Volt Seed a lot more recently. <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, he was one. so close. They're up so there, good. and that's a lot of damage. Oh and that's my the game, goodness! And that's the set. One whiff. One whiff smash, and that was it. I mean, and, and if he connected.